Who's this coarse person with the foreign accent? downtown Doc Watson style. So, cape on the fourth fret. That should be an E, I guess. I think. <laughs> I hope I'm right, or else I'm gonna embarrass myself. So, this is a classic way to, to kick it off, you know. down even more. section for section now. Do 
that and pause the video then you do this and then you pause the video and then you do this do that section do that together until you get it before you do the next part I need to practice this or at least I need to warm up I just got home so uh, anyway you need to do that part a lot So that lick you can do it over and over and over and over again and uh, you can do this just do that part over and over again until you get it do it like a you practice a long lick Also do that part like you were doing a long uh, Doc Watson lick. That's how I do if I do something I've never done before. I play it and pretend I do a nice little dock or tonari slick like over and over and over again 500 times a minute you see <laughs> i just played wrong This is a pretty intermediate, maybe even advanced. Uh, so what you could do when you learn this, you can play a basic version first. If you if you want to record you, yourself or play with other, and you know know you're gonna play this, uh, uh, you have a solo two times. I wouldn't start with this. I would start with some something simpler, and you know, end with a fancy stuff. So maybe just do this first time. version you can do of this tune if you ask me and it, it's not nothing wrong with it I love it right so so if you if you know you're gonna play this solo two times the first time don't do the fancy stuff end with it so you know it's it's more fun like that and um, you need to be relaxed as well when you jam with people don't like don't feel like you yes yes it's my turn now I'm gonna do this fancy lick I practiced because you're gonna fail 
I promise you, you're gonna fail if you do that. Just relax, don't think about it. Maybe improvise, but you don't even think about it either. I do it all the time. Uh, when I started, like, let's say three years ago, I was like that, you know. Oh, I can't wait uh, until I do this in a jam. What happens then is if you miss a note, you miss the whole solo. Why is that? Because and the reason you miss the solo and how you're gonna do it is you have the notes in your head and you do it wrong and you're gonna F it up. You're gonna lose, lose it all if you're not an amazing improviser or in intermediate even. So you get the point. And I hope this lesson was helpful and uh, I do love this Picard. And no, I am not endorsed by Torto Picard, but he does the best Toner Ice Picard if you ask me. I like this guitar a lot too. It, it got dust in it. Can you hear it? This is from the bracing when I shaved the bracing. And no, I have not. I have not. Listen to me now. It's not me who have relicked this guitar. I bought it from Japan. Got it from a guy named. Oh. Yeah. Pronounce a Japanese name. Toshiharu Guda. <laughs> Maybe something like that. Anyway. Um, and uh, I got a video when David Greer plays my guitar. That's pretty badass if you ask me. So, I hope this lesson was helpful and uh, love you all and thanks everyone who follow me and please 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 subscribe. It's free so subscribe and if you wanna donate PayPal below but subscribe please it's 100% free and you get the notification when I upload a clip so and it's my lessons are free it's free to subscribe so I don't see why not. If you like me and you watch, subscribe.